George Haber, CEO of Cleveland Clinic Abu Dhabi. It's wonderful to have you here with us at Econom Middle East. Thank you so much. Thank you for having me. Now, recently, Cleveland Clinic Abu Dhabi performed the first robotic procedure in the region. How important is this milestone for Cleveland Clinic Abu Dhabi? And what does it mean for the healthcare industry as well as the region? You know, th thank you for your question. 2024 have been a special year for us in terms of surgical innovation, and especially robotic surgical innovation. We performed multiple firsts uh, in robotic surgery. First robotic kidney transplant, uh, first robotic donor and recipient kidney transplant with one robot. We also performed the first robotic mastectomy. The robotic mastectomy was the first one that was done across the whole Cleveland Clinic enterprise, and it was developed and done here at Cleveland Clinic Abu Dhabi. In addition to this, we also uh, started a robotic focal therapy program to treat prostate cancer and another robotic program to uh, treat benign prostatic hypertrophy, which is an enlarged prostate. So a lot of development and a lot of innovations and a lot of first in robotic surgeries. And what innovations is Cleveland Clinic Abu Dhabi showcasing here at Arab Health 2025? You know, a lot of great things are happening these days uh, in, in terms of, uh, of innovation and, and advancement and new technologies. We were hearing a lot about AI, about precision medicine, about genomics, and about robotics, as, as we just uh, discussed. Um, those are things that Cleveland Clinic Abu Dhabi is heavily invested in. Uh, we are developing multiple AI agents to help patients, make sure the patients are getting the best quality of care, for example, we performed over 2,000 colonoscopy that were aided with AI to increase the diagnostic accuracy of colonoscopies. We're using um, uh, other AI agents, uh, for example, to predict the risk of sepsis and decrease the mortality that's associated with risk of sepsis and other uh, ways of using uh, AI uh, to improve our workflows. In addition to this, um, we continue to increase our surgical uh, oncological in innovation and increasing our precision medicine, especially in oncology. Wonderful. And finally, what do you see as the biggest trends shaping the future of healthcare, not just in, in the region, but globally? You know, uh, technology have always played a huge role in healthcare. Um, what we've seen uh, recently with the advances in AI, I think we're turning a problem of... Uh, of medicine being an art and a science into an engineering problem. And once we turn something into an engineering problem, that's when we find solution. And I'm very excited uh, that we're going to see the next two to three years, a lot of advancement and a lot of solutions to problems that you've had over a hundred years and more. We're going to find solutions for them in the next two years. And that's exciting me a lot.